adhering to the corporate mission of providing green energy for a better life. Tanatatang has been committed to the 2030 carbon peak and 2060 carbon neutrality goal by developing an energy mix of wind, solar, hydro, coal fire, gas fire, and nuclear power. Wind has been accelerating green and low carbon development. Multi energy complementary. From Bulke Pro's 10 million kilowatt wind solar thermal storage multi energy complementary energy base in Inner Mongolia, to Zhejiang Shanshan Changdatu Fishery complementary photovoltaic power project. China the Han has stepped up efforts to build five 10 million kilowatt energy bases across China, million kilowatt new energy bases, and distributed energy resources in central and southeast China. By 2025, clean energy capacity will account for more than 50%. Technological innovation. Driven by technological innovation, China the Tang has made significant progress on projects, including Xijiang Jiala Hydropower Station, Ni Jia Zhongni Compressed Air Energy Storage Project, Shandong Yunzhen 630 degrees Celsius Ultra Supercritical Secondary Reheat Power Project, and Inner Mongolia Kulun Green Hydrogen Coupling Coal Chemical Project. Anna the Tang has built a digital transformation roadmap to enhance total factor productivity and create a competitive advantage for high quality development. Embrace the love, win the future. From the past to the present, the Silk Road has connected the East and West. China the Tang has achieved fruitful results under the Belt and Road Initiative. We have presence in more than 10 countries, including Southeast Asia, Central Asia, Europe, and Africa. With about 2,000 overseas employees, and a localization rate of 80%. As of the end of 2023, we're operating seven projects, including Cambodia Power Transmission Project, Myanmar Dapeng Hydropower Station, Cambodia Sung Akai Hydropower Station, New Labo, Kendani, Kalpeng, and Sung Cell Power Plants in Indonesia with the approved Akbeng Hydropower Project in Laos and the Buka Solar Photovoltaic Project in Uzbekistan and the total capacity is estimated to be 4,000 megawatts. Integrating ESP factors in our investment life cycle, we support long-term, sustainable growth that generates economic and social benefits for all individuals and communities. Nikatang ESSP Power Indonesia won five stars of the top CSR awards in 2024. Strive together for excellence. Looking forward, guided by the beacon of culture of excellence, we strive together for excellence by building a world-class power supply featuring green and low-carbon development, multi-energy complementary, efficient synergy, and visual intelligence. Let's join hands to build a clean and beautiful world, making the earth green and the future brighter. Your Excellency, good afternoon. Welcome to China Data. Now we are at the China Data Dispatching Center. Please allow me to give you a brief introduction. Currently, China Data's total power generation capacity is 184 gigawatts, including 97 gigawatts of all-field power, 27 gigawatts of hydropower, 
Similar to work of wind power, 9 to work of gas belt power, and 70 to work of solar power. From this map, you can see that our project are distributed in 32 provinces, regions in China, as well as in countries such as Indonesia, Myanmar, etc. This is the real time overview of our production and option status. Through the collection and transmission of on site treatment, the dispatcher center can monitor the real time flow, start up, and stand by of all units in real time. Meanwhile, the equipment the status is also active. Alarm will prompt if there is equipment malfunction or failure. The production snow will take measures to inspect and recover. This is the distribution of 236 power per hour units. On the right side of the screen, we can see the date for load. Fuel consumption, environmental protection of all units. This is the world's largest coal fire power plant, Tokyo Solar Power Plant in Inner Mongolia, with a total installed capacity of 6.72 gigawatt. The last power of screen displays the real time state of the new power plant, the current power rate, and the power generated per day till now. This is the distribution of 425 fiber power units. On the left side of the screen, you can see the status of all fiber power units. On the right side of the screen, there is a paper for all fiber power equipment. This is the sixth largest fiber power station in China, Longshan Fiber Power Station in Wuhan, with installed capacity of 4.9 gigawatt. On the left side of the screen, we can see the current load lift and the power bandwidth is available now. This is the distribution of all wind plants. On the right side of the screen, we can see the average effective wind speed of the wind fans, the daily and the monthly power generation, as well as the load chain. This is the Saitan Park Farm with a total installed capacity of 1.51 gigawatt, which was completed and put into COP in 2007. On the left side of the screen, real time load and the current power generation of the wind farm is displayed. On the right side of the screen, the operation status of all wind tanks at this scene. This is the distribution of all solar power plants. On the right side of the screen, you can see the daily and monthly load chains of each plant. This is a countdown to solar power plant with a total installed capacity of 0 0.3 gigawatt. The left side of the screen displays real time load and the daily power generation. On the right side of the screen, we can see the daily generation pin, utility hours, load curve, and the real time equipment parameters. My colleagues are on duty here 24 hours a day. Canada now will continue participating in international cooperation and actively push forward the global energy transformation. Mm. This is all for the report. Thank you. Please move to the eighth floor. Thank you.